Using highly concentrated sodium electrolyte, we have investigated a small molecule organic compound called pillar 5 q non encapsulated within mesoporous carbon as a high capacity cathode for rechargeable organic sodium ion battery and achieve a record cycling stability even at an elevated temperature. As electrolyte is being called the heart of the battery, it plays a pivotal role in improving the electrochemical performance of the battery. Electrolyte is the liquid component of the battery that conducts electrical current by allowing the passage of ions through it. It basically serves as a medium through which the charge carrier ions shuttle between the cathode and anode of the battery. It influences the battery performance to a large extent. For example, it influences the for, uh, formation of solid electrolyte interface. It uh, determines the electrochemical uh, potential window. And further, for an electrolyte to be good for the battery, it should have a good ionic conductivity, should be electrical insulator. That is, it should not allow the passage of electrons through it, must be chemically and thermally stable and furthermore, it should be compatible with both the electrode of the battery. Further, electrolyte influences the economic impact and cost of the battery. Sustainable and eco-friendly electrolyte material can impact the battery more in terms of environmental friendliness and economically viable. So overall, advancement in organic rechargeable batteries highly depend on the development of new electrolyte that meets these certain criteria. As of organic batteries are concerned, it is widely known that organic material suffers from poor capacity and low coulombic efficiency due to their unavoidable dissolution into the organic electrolyte. In fact, since dissolution is an interaction between the active material and the electrolyte, thus electrolyte play a crucial role in, um, in the dissolvability of the material and thus influences the electrochemical performance of the battery. Small molecule organic compounds have opened a new avenue for the next generation of green and sustainable battery. But due to their high dissolution uh, into the, aqua, into the uh, electrolyte and poor electrical conductivity impede their further research progress. So in order to address this issue, we have adopted a dual mitigating strategy. Firstly, we have encapsulated the pillar Q non, pillar 5 Q non into the mesoporous carbon to enhance its electrical conductivity and further we have make use of highly concentrated sodium electrolyte to inhibit the dissolution of the active material into the electrolyte and thus increase the electrochemical performance of the sodium ion battery. The biggest challenge is that we have faced is to inhibit the dissolution of this pillar 5 q non material into the aprotic organic electrolyte and to increase its electrical conductivity for of the electro of the electrode so these uh, to you know, so in order to overcome its electrical uh, conductivity issue we have tried several conducting carbon such as super b65 ketgen black carbon black and even we have tried a varieties of electrolyte to stop the dissolution of pillar 5q non into the aprotic organic electrolyte this small molecule, pillar 5 q non, is highly dissolvable in most of the electrolyte that we have tested. So during our initial test, because of its high dissolution problem, the cycling stability of the uh, battery and its capacity was very poor. Yeah, with the progress of our research work, we found that physically mixing the conducting carbon electrode, carbon material into our electrode was not helping us to improve the cycling stability of pillar 5 q non and to getting the, an improved electrochemical performance. So what we thought of is to first make a composite, electro, a composite material with the pillar 5 q non and a suitable conducting carbon. In order to do so, we have encapsulated this pillar 5 q non with the highly porous mesoporous carbon called CMK3 by a solution impregnation method. And towards the end, we have increases the electrical conductivity by providing a three-dimensional electrical conducting network by adding a small amount of CNT into the final electrode. 
Secondly, we have make use of highly concentrated sodium ion electrolyte in order to stop the dissolution of this pillar 5 quinone into our electrolyte. So this dual mitigating strategy help us to achieve a record cycling, cycling stability and improve electrochemical performance both at ambient temperature and, and at an elevated temperature of around 40 degrees centigrade. With the successful incorporation of our dual mating strategy into the rechargeable organic sodium and battery, we are in a process of applying a similar kind of concept into the multivalent ion batteries as well. Furthermore, there is an scope uh, to increase the electrode to modify the electrode structure for the much better if you, sodium ion diffusion into the active materials. In addition to it, if uh, we can drastically reduce the dissolution of the pillar 5 quinone into the organic electrolyte if we go for a composite polymer electrolyte. This composite polymer electrolyte can significantly improve the cycling stability and electrochemical performance of the battery because the active material dissolution can be largely re reduced. <laughs>